Well, a hail apocalypse, guys. A hail apocalypse in Uganda. What in the world is going on in Uganda, guys? Really quick, though, if you don't mind giving this video a like. Also, sharing this video with your friends and family, that always helps me out a great deal. And if you guys are new, just checking me out here for the first time, please click that subscribe button, browse through and check out some of our other great video content and click the little bell too, guys, to get all of my notifications because YouTube is trying to censor me and I would appreciate it, guys, if you did that and just swing by and keep checking out the channel for more great content. So Uganda, guys, we have a hail apocalypse. Unfortunately, 13 people killed, another 100 injured in some apocalyptic type hailstorms and rainstorms that struck there on Easter night. That's right, on Easter night, the worst of these storms came in between the hours of 8 p.m. and 10.30 p.m. They said of the 13 that died, they said they were most likely washed away into a swamp area where they drowned. I mean, you just talk about a horrible way to go. Now, there was one woman who actually elected to stay in her house and lock the door and try to ride out this storm, but her ceiling ended up caving in on her and collapsing on top of her, and she ended up injured. So out of all the ones that are injured, they were taken off to local hospitals there in the area in Uganda. Now, guys, there's still people missing as well. So there's still search and rescue efforts going on to try to dig people out of the rubble. This affected three different villages there where the storms came in. And also it destroyed over 300 homes. I mean, you guys have to understand, these are not the strongest homes in the world. So it does not take much uh, for them to be destroyed, especially when you have a hailstorm like this that lasted on top of that for as long as it did. This is just a tragedy, but it's another sign of the end times as we see this apocalyptic weather taking place, crazy weather all over the world. These storms, guys, are getting bigger. They're getting more intense. Uh, and the injuries and deaths that we're seeing from these things are just adding up to just uh, ridiculous levels. Please keep all those in prayer in Uganda um, for everything happening right now after this storm. Guys, as always, thank you so much for all of your support and for spending a couple of minutes of your day with me today. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you, and I will talk with you soon.